Hi Big Tractor Power fans, this video comes to you from a central Illinois field where a Case International 7110 Magnum tractor and 900 Cyclo Air Planner are putting corn in the ground. In this video, we're going to take a look at the tractor's production history, specifications, and original price tag, as well as talking about the Cyclo Air Planner. But first, let's head out to the field so you can see and hear this planting team in action. The 7110 tractor is part of the 7100 series of Magnum tractors from Case International that were offered from 1987 through 1993. There were initially four models ranging from 130 to 195 horsepower that included the 7110, 7120, 7130, and 7140. In 1990, an additional 215 PTO horsepower tractor, the model 7150, was added to the lineup. The 7110 is powered by a CDC 8.3 liter 504 cubic inch engine rated at 130 PTO horsepower. The tractor in this video is equipped with a Silent Guardian 2 cab and it could also be ordered with a four post ROPS option. When customers ordered a 7110 Magnum, they had three different transmissions to choose from. The first is a full power shift with 18 forward and two reverse speeds. The second option was a full power shift with 18 forward and four reverse speeds. And the third option was a full power shift with 24 forward and three reverse speeds. The 7110 came from the factory with a standard 75 gallon diesel fuel tank. Customers could order an optional 95 gallon diesel fuel tank. The tractor weighed in from the Racine, Wisconsin tractor factory at 15,068 pounds. It can be field weighted up to 16,690 pounds. The model that we see working in the field 
is a two-wheel drive version of the 7110, and its original price tag was $68,782. Customers could order a 7110 Magnum with front-wheel assist. The four-wheel drive axle Magnum would run $79,457 when it was new. The original 7100 series of Magnum tractors and the 7200 and 8900 series tractors that followed earned a solid reputation in the field and have fondly become known as the boxcar magnums. This 7110 Magnum tractor is planning with a Case International 900 Cyclo Air Planner. International Harvester first introduced the Cyclo Air Planner back in 1971. It was a revolutionary machine in its time because it eliminated the need for planner plates, clutches, and all the other devices that were connected with planners at that time. The Cyclo Air Planner was the first bulk fill style planner on the market. It uses an air metering system to deliver the corn seeds or soybean seeds from a central fill tank to the row units that put the crop in the ground. The central fill box on the Case International 900 Cyclo Air Planner holds 15 bushels. This 12 row model has two boxes which carry a total of 30 bushels of corn seed and can cover around 70 acres per fill up. The central fill box is fitted with a stainless steel planter drum that meters the seed as it's delivered through the air system out to the row units. This drum can be interchanged for different sizes of corn seed, soybeans, and other crops that will be planted in a row crop style setting. The Case International 900 series of Cyclo Air Planners were available in a variety of sizes and configurations from four rows to 16 rows. The planner in this video is a 12 row vertical fold model, which means the outside three row units on both sides fold up into the air to take this from a 30 foot planner down to a 15 foot planner for transport. The Case International 900 series of corn planters were manufactured by Case International at its East Moline, Illinois factory, which is best known for manufacturing the Axle Flow Combine. The Cyclo Air 900 series was built during the late 1980s and early 1990s in a vertical fold 12 row 900 series planner sold for $27,606 new. I hope you've enjoyed hearing and seeing these Case International farm machines at work out in the field planting corn. And if you'd like to see more videos like this one, consider subscribing to Big Tractor Power YouTube, where there's over 1,000 videos of farm machines in action. If you've enjoyed the content of this video, consider giving it a thumbs up as it helps alert other tractor fans on YouTube that the video is here to see. As always, thank you for watching. Make sure to click on the notifications bell as well so you'll know when the next Big Tractor Power video is released. New videos are coming out almost every day from the channel. If you have any questions or thoughts about this video, please leave them in the comment section below as I try to respond to every post that is made. If you would like to get a preview of what is coming up next on Big Tractor Power YouTube, make sure to check out Big Tractor Power Instagram where I share pictures and short video clips of what is currently being filmed in the field. As always, thank you for watching. 